leave it to contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. Now, at the time, you were the only analyst in the world to mention that it would starve the banks. All right, Reggie Middleton, you are building what you call a virtual Goldman Sachs on top of Bitcoin. Tell us about it. Well, a virtual Goldman Sachs on top of the Bitcoin and protocol and network sends the extreme conflicts of interest and the uh, excessive bonus compensation. It's sort of long. So basically, I'm building a more efficient financial system. Not to be impolite, but what makes you so special that they all want to read your blog? Um, I can step on toes and be objective, objective and uh, offensively honest. Bitcoin. Now, as the price of the cryptocurrency vaults higher and higher, a lot of people are beginning to take notice. And is Bitcoin a bubble about to crash, or is it even a currency at all? Here to break down the bits and give us his forecast of where the world of technology is heading is Reggie Middleton, independent investor and financial blogger. Greetings, this is Reggie Middleton, and I'm here to give a quick video introduction to my latest entrepreneurial pursuit. These are the Boom Bus Zero Trust Bitcoin contracts. These contracts were designed by me to give individuals and institutions exposure into and out of Bitcoin from a wide variety of fiat currencies. Basically, um, this is a trustless or no need for trust digital contract, not necessarily paper contract or legal contract, but digital contract that allows you to basically um, gain or invest in Bitcoin turn in terms of exposure or invest in other fiat currencies in terms of exposure without making an actual transaction. Of course, you do have to have Bitcoin. You know, it's Bitcoin in and Bitcoin out. Um, this is very innovative, very unique. As far as I know personally, nobody anywhere on this God-given earth has done anything like this, which makes me very excited. And I think at least those who understand the potential of the Bitcoin protocol and the Bitcoin currency and cryptographic currencies in general, I think you will be very excited as well. And here, this is your uh, public address, Bitcoin address, which you can send it to others to receive Bitcoins. And uh, here you can send the Bitcoins by pasting the other parties uh, Bitcoin address just like this same uh, and also you can add the amount of Bitcoins how many Bitcoins you want to send A request for it uh, to swap a currency you can open this dialog and add a request for instance I want I want to swap uh, like 10 US dollars with bitcoins for five minutes okay so here you can set the margin 
uh, at which level you uh, want to match a uh, match a request like for instance if i say to 20 percent then if another transaction if another request is available near to the plus or minus 20 percent then that will be available visible to you to match to accept that one so here i will uh, click on the find so now this is uh, immediately available but its status is not found yet means there is no any uh, uh, offer for the moment available so now what I'll do is I will run another client as a client 2 and will add another request opposite to this one in order to show you how it really matches the two transactions two requests okay now uh, here is the client 2 this is just another instance of this application which has his own wallet and here it has 0 0.2 available bitcoins to use so i add another request opposite to uh, this one i will say i want to exchange 0 0.02 bitcoin 0 0.01 bitcoins uh, with us dollars so uh, for five minutes here as you can see i have uh, uh, I have I'm trying to add a request for 0.01 Bitcoin but here you will see the 0.02 because it adds a hundred percent collateral margin it adds a hundred percent collateral margin it adds a hundred percent collateral margin super secure in comparison to what the world is used to, um, super fast in comparison to what the world is used to, and super malleable and flexible, again, in comparison to what the world is used to. And most importantly, super cheap, you know, damn near free in comparison to what are the um, big investment banks are clients That's why you see the devil amount over here. So now I'll add a request to find. Now, as you can see, this transition has been found as a close match. So these both has been uh, found. So if you want to accept this one, uh, like for instance, if I accept this uh, this transition first, this uh, request, so you see it will take out the balance from this wallet. So as you can see, it has been 0 0.15 something. And uh, now this has been moved from this table to list contracts table and here you will see that its status is accepted right now the contract has not been started until uh, unless until the other party accept the um, the offer your offer now this transaction has also been accepted and the balance has been locked up so once we accept the uh, any offer then our amount is locked so uh, nobody can use it so now i'll go to the list of contracts and here uh, you can see that this contract has been started before it was and hey if you go this also has been started started so after three minutes it will be completed and uh, whatever the profit and loss will be mentioned over here so if the bitcoins go up then uh, this per this party will get paid and this party will uh, this party will pay to this party simple enough so now let's wait for three minutes and see what result it comes out so the possibility is it could be zero as well if a rate doesn't change within three minutes
as you can see here now is uh, this party has to pay 0 0.17 bitcoins to this party uh, this is the rate difference between the start date and the end date i equivocate i equivocate bitcoin to the internet in the early 90s uh, it was a uh, curiosity uh, a lot of people thought it was a nerd fad and right now most people couldn't survive or continue their day-to-day -day activities without the internet bitcoin is severely misunderstood bitcoin is uh, should be bifurcated and thought of as two parts a bitcoin with a lowercase b which is a digital currency based on cryptographic methods and crypto cryptography and bitcoin with a capital b which is a protocol and a network based upon that protocol of which that currency is able to travel so you have two parts of bitcoin um, almost all the attention the media attention and investor and speculator attention is focused on bitcoin with the lowercase b the digital currency which is very interesting especially considering you know it has a meteoric rise you know sixty thousand percent returns etc but what is of real interest is the protocol that Bitcoin travels along in the network. That allows you to do things such as program the money and make smart money. On my road to Bitcoin, um, I've been doing a lot of research. Uh, I can tell you quickly how this got started. Throughout the last year and a half, a lot of my clients have been asking me for my opinion on Bitcoin. And due to resource constraints, uh, I haven't really been, been able to really dig in deep. Um, that's my fault. It was my mistake. And I'm actually very late to the party. But when I did look into it, I looked into it in the typical Reggie Middleton fashion. No preconceived notions, no prejudices, no biases. I simply wanted to look at it in terms of the risk-adjusted reward that it offered and from a global macro perspective, as well as from a micro perspective as well. When I looked into it, um, I can't say I'm a fan of Bitcoin or the cryptocurrencies, but I'm a very, very avid student. And when I did look into it, I really, really um, appreciated and enjoyed what I saw. And I really liked what I saw. And I'm taking the programmability of this currency and I'm planning to bring it mainstream. I will replicate a lot of the functions of the money center banks, commercial banks, and investment banks, okay, as well as certain financial services in the P2P network peer-to-peer -peer network. And leave it to contrarian, badass Reggie Middleton 